Some parade in uh, North London, Hampstead Heath, is ditching Father Christmas in favour of... Uh, Go on, take a take a uh, take a wild guess. Mother Christmas, yeah, exactly. Father Christmas is one of the few remaining unifying icons in our society. He's pretty diverse, just like many of the strapping young lads arriving on the southern coast every hour. He goes by different names in different countries: Le Père Noël, Babo Natale, the Vinachtsman. Uh, pretty diverse, but not sufficiently so for our time. So he's being replaced by well, can you guess? Trans Father Christmas, Muller Christmas, Rudolph the Unvaccinated Reindeer. They never let Paul Rudolph join in any reindeer games, not until he gets that double jab. No, they're cancelling Father Christmas in favour of Mother Christmas. You're uh, going so sleepy. Uh, there are multiple Mother Christmases, apparently. Santa is a polygamist, and they're going for a kind of Margaret Atwood handsmaid's tale vibe. Take a look at this. These are all the Mother Christmas. Yeah, look at those uh, Mother Christmas ladies. So you wear a Christmas wreath on your head and then stick candles in it and set them alight. Is that in compliance with post-EU health and safety? Uh, going around with lighted candles on your head could all get a little incendiary if you run into a chap on his way to Liverpool Women's Hospital. Uh, Father Christmas is a woman. Superman's a bi guy. The new James Bond is a Somali asylum seeker posing as a Sudanese asylum seeker who's converted to the Church of England and is living in the room above M's garage. Uh, but do let me know if you've got a most boring diversity story of the week. Mother Christmas is certainly that. I remember as a young lad with the independent newspaper when it started. I think the first Christmas it started, I was sent to see a production in which somebody sang, I saw daddy kissing Santa Claus. It, uh, it, was, it was novel back then and it's all so boring now.